I know to the male guy yesterday, I probably was just like a hot mess. Because I opened the door and I had like the biggest grin on my face. He had the box in his hands and I was like, oh. oh. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I have something really, really exciting. Um, from the title alone, you guys can probably already guess it. I asked you guys on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter if you wanted me to do an unboxing video of my very first Christian Louis Vuitton Pigals. And a lot of you said yes. I got them yesterday, but I didn't have time to film. So the box was just literally sitting there on my desk haunting me it's like open me open me. i wanted to open them so bad i've been looking for some nude pumps for a really really long time i had a pair from nine west that i beat those shoes to death i wore them so much there's something about a classic nude pointy toe pump that just adds so much cuteness and elegance to the leg i knew automatically that i either wanted the nude pattern or the black pattern and since I'm a huge nude fanatic, it was just, it was meant to be for me to get a nude pair. I'm probably gonna seem extra nervous, extra jittery. That's only because I'm really, really excited about this. You don't know how hard it was not to open this box, but I promised that I was gonna do the unboxing video, and here I am. It's like it's Christmas. I had a gift wrap. It's so pretty. I'm really nervous. I did write myself a little message. Yes, I'm cheesy, I'm corny. And it says, da, 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 da. can't get it open. It says, because you're worth it. Love cat's place. <laughs> yes, I did say cat's place. As cheesy as that sounds, because you're worth it. I've been doing a lot of research on which pair I wanted to get, and I decided on these. I got them in the 100 millimeter, which is pretty much the four inch heel. They had the 120s and the soul case, which are so, so, so beautiful. But I wasn't sure if I could, if I could or if I should do a close five inch heel on my first pair only because I don't normally rock five inch heels. The four inch heels are a lot closer to what I normally wear and so <laughs> no flabbing. Oh my God, I'm so These are extra heel taps. It comes in this nice little cute velvet bag or whatever material this is. It says Christian Louboutin Paris. This is a dust bag for my shoes for when I travel. some pictures on Instagram so check me out I'm at cat's place on Instagram so if you want to see how these look in an outfit I'll definitely be showcasing these in future outfit videos too so stay tuned guys I did try them on they do fit me a bit tight which I expected from the reviews that I read across from here they do run narrow I am a little bit flat-footed so I'm gonna take some of the suggestions that I got from watching other YouTube videos of girls who already have these shoes on what I could do just to stretch this out a bit because that's where the discomfort is. As I wear these, they'll stretch out. They'll definitely stretch out. If you guys have any questions on the sizing, on how they fit or anything like that, I can do like an updated video once I've worn them in. Let me know in the comments below if that's something that you guys would want to see. For the most part, you can't get any kind of discounts when you're buying these specific designer shoes. I don't know about any others because I don't have any others, but if 
you go through Ebates, you can get a credit back. It's basically a way to get paid for shopping. So if you shop on Sephora, Forever 21, they have so many different stores. I'm not affiliated with this company. I'm just giving you guys a tip. All you have to do is create an account. It's free. There's no charge. You're clicking onto like a Forever 21 or Neiman Marcus through the Ebates website. So by doing that, it creates a record and they'll send you a check for a percentage of what you pay. So if you spend $500 buying a pair of shoes, you can get like 4% back. I bought them through Ebates and they're gonna send me a check for $27. So it's essentially like a discount. You can use it for plenty of other sites. I've used it for Sephora so many times and I'll get $5 here, $10 there. This is the biggest one because this is the biggest purchase that I've made. But just so you guys know, I'm gonna leave the link below if you wanna check it out. I would highly suggest creating an account. It's free and you get money back. So um, I thought it was a cool site. I wanna share it with you guys. And if it's helpful for you, then great. With that, I want to say thank you so much for joining me. Thank you so much for watching me open my very first pair of Louis Vuitton shoes. I was really excited to share this with you guys. A little more nervous because I'm on camera. I feel just a little bit nervous. Like, oh my gosh, I don't want to come across as... I don't want to come across as I'm showing off or anything like that. That's not my intention. I simply want to share my excitement with you on, on buying these awesome awesome shoes so if you guys are in the market if you guys see something or if there's something that you're in the market for that you've wanted for a really 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 long time treat yourself guys you only live once thanks so much for watching guys and i'll see you in the next video i know to the mail guy yesterday i probably was just like a hot mess because i opened the door and i had like the biggest grin on my face like hello <laughs> he had the box he had the box in his hands and i was like oh and he gave it to me and I couldn't believe that it was mine. I was like, thank you. And it was snowing, so I was so worried that it was going to be put off for another day. Because I was just like a little OCD. I did try to order them from another website. I ordered them and then I got the email saying that it was cancelled because they weren't in stock. So when I ordered them from Barney's and I got the email saying it was shipped and um, the tracking didn't update, I thought that it was the same thing. So... I kept on checking the tracking, checking the tracking, checking the tracking. It finally showed that it was moving and I was like, oh my God, I need to come here. Then yesterday it started snowing and I was like, oh my God, no, it's gonna be pushed back another day. I can't wait anymore. I've been, I can't wait anymore. I've been waiting so long. But they're finally here and I'm super happy with them. There I go again with the soup.